Hey everyone, I'm Hannah and this is my monthly thrift haul video where I'm gonna show you everything I thrifted in the month of November. And I almost didn't make this video, but I knew that you guys would be mad. It's just that I didn't do a lot of thrifting this month. I think I went to like three stores and I didn't even spend $20 because at one of the stores I found $5 crammed inside an old wallet. But the show must go on, so here is what I managed to find. I found just a few non-clothing items and the first one would be this vintage Christmas troll ornament. I also got some scrapbooking paper, which I will use for backgrounds on Instagram photos. So be sure to follow me there so you can see these in action. And lastly, I got a 1992 board game of the Jeopardy Home Edition. I scored some accessories like this green scarf. Then this pink Clinique makeup bag. I'm saying that three times fast, pink Clinique. I know these kind of bags are given out as gifts, but I'm not fancy enough to buy that many Clinique products. So I got this one for really cheap and it just screamed me. <laughs> <laughs> and the last accessory I found was another free makeup bag. This one was from Ipsy. And it might look familiar either because you have it or earlier this year I did a giveaway for my birthday and I gave one of these away. And I always kind of wish that I still had it because I think it looks really great in photos on my Instagram. <laughs> so pretty happy to have come across it. And now, are you ready for it? These are the clothes that I found. So tis the season for ugly sweaters. I have never specifically bought an ugly Christmas sweater, but now that I work at a retail store, we have the possibility of an ugly Christmas sweater day. And I actually don't think this one is very ugly. This is a vintage Mickey Mouse sweater that says happy holidays. And I think it's a children's sweater because it doesn't fit my arms very well. <laughs> and I figure when the holiday is over, I have a lot of Disney loving friends. I will probably pass it along to one of them. So when I said that I've only thrifted three times this month, two of those visits were to the same community closet where I got some free clothes and I made some questionable decisions. <laughs> there was this cropped vintage sweater with a black and white checkerboard print. I mean, it's pretty cool, but the thing I liked was that it was by the brand Ward, which if you know anything about me, I collect old catalogs. I have a lot of Ward's catalogs and I was just really curious if I could find it in one of my old Ward's catalogs. I probably won't, but stay tuned. <laughs> then I got another thing that I really don't see like staying in my closet very long. It was just kind of a fun thing. It's this red circle skirt. And I know red looks really good on me but I don't really wear circle skirts. I know there's a lot of fabulous gals on Instagram who rock them with like a vintage pinup style and that's not me, but it kind of appealed to me for like some pretty Christmas looks. Plus again, I look really good in red. <laughs> Next, I got something that is very me and that is a black and white striped skirt. This one was kind of interesting too because it has a drawstring waistband, but also elastic. And then it has a curved hem that goes up on the sides, kind of like dolphin shorts. And then it's made of a very cozy material. So it's kind of like, athleisure? I don't know. We'll see what I do with it. I did happen to find something from my thrifting wish list. Well, not my thrifting wish list. It was my sister had me put it on my thrifting wish list because it's something for her. And it's a chambray tunic. I've probably been looking for about a year and a half now. So just so you know, the good thrift finds don't happen overnight. But when I saw it, I thought it was really cute and I actually don't know if she still wants it. Um, so I thought that I would try it on and if it didn't work, I would just give it to her. But it looked really good on me, so I'm probably not gonna give it to her now. <laughs> sorry, not sorry. By the way, quick plug before I continue, if you wanna know the thrift stores that I've been going to, I've been writing reviews on my blog, theoutfitrepeater.com, where you can see the stores that I'm visiting. I will leave a link to those posts down below. Sorry if that felt like some weird commercial break. Anyways, back to the thrift haul. <laughs> Next, I am very serious in my pursuit to find some solid basics for my closet, like, you know, this yellow shirt that I'm wearing. So I found this purple t-shirt. And it's not just like any purple t-shirt, so it has like slight high-low hem, and then it has all these little flat studs all over it. So cute. And I always feel like it's difficult to thrift good purple clothes. Is that just me? Cause this is like one of the only purple things I've ever thrifted. Let me know. Then like the greatest thing that I thrifted this month. This is not the last thing I have to show you. It's just the greatest, <laughs> but it's also not that great. It is a white ribbed turtleneck. The reason I say it's the greatest is because I have worn it at least like once or twice every week, including I wore it on Thanksgiving. It is quickly becoming one of my favorite pieces in my closet. So if you also have a white turtleneck and you need some outfit inspiration, be sure to follow my blog, link down below. <laughs> this video is full of plugs. Oh, one more plug. <laughs> 
very, very soon in the month of December, I am going to be interviewed live on Facebook by Sammy D of Sammy D Vintage, the thrifting legend. It's gonna be in her Facebook group called Thrift Babes. I will have a link down below in case you have trouble finding the Thrift Babes Facebook group. About a month ago, Sammy did try to interview me and we had a lot of technical difficulties. So we're gonna try again. She's gonna do an interview with me. We're gonna talk all about thrifting and thrifting. <laughs> And then later in December, Sammy is also going to have a whole bunch of thrifters and we're gonna do live thrift haul videos. So it's gonna be pretty awesome. You're gonna wanna join that group. It's free, it's on Facebook. Just come join us, hang out, it's a good time. And last but not least is something I didn't actually thrift. This is something that my mom found and because she'll never be on camera, she said that I was allowed to show this to you guys. She is far superior to me when it comes to thrifting things. So she found this dark green sweatshirt that says whatever. <laughs> and that's my mom, you guys. <laughs> and that's also the end of my thrift haul. Thank you all so much for watching. If you enjoy the content that I create, then be sure to support it by following along, liking, commenting, sharing my stuff with your friends, all that good stuff. Hopefully I will see you in future videos. And in the meantime, be excellent to each other.